What's going on everyone? It's Rich Lux and in today's video, girl, you won't believe the drama. Okay, so Jaclyn Hill took to her social media to rant and rave about an upcoming huge mega sale that's going on to help promote her palette. Uh, I found it kind of interesting that she was like, oh yeah guys, um, just so that you know, there's a bag. We're giving away a free bag with purchase or something like that. You know, I was getting the team wrong. Okay, girl, we're giving away a free bag. And then if you buy a Jaclyn Hill product, you get a free Jaclyn Hill brush. I'm just like, listen, I love a good deal. Trust me. Okay, I love, I always said no matter how rich I get, I'm always going to collect coupons and try to get a good deal on stuff. I totally get it. But at this point, I view Jaclyn Hill as like a luxury brand. And I kind of feel like when you start doing the like buy one, get two free or buy one, get one free. I, li I like that. You know, a lot of brands in the makeup industry, in the community, they do this thing where, you know, they'll give you a free lipstick if you spend so much money. That's cool, right? I get it. But at this point, what Jaclyn Hill, I feel, is going a little bit overboard and giving away too much. And it just, to me, it's cheapening the brand when you start giving away too much. You know, you know, like you don't put a bumper sticker on a Bentley type of situation. So here's what she had to say. And uh, we'll come back and we'll talk after the jump. Hey guys, happy Valentine's Day. Jordan and I just got home from out running the rain. We decided to stop back here and just kind of like unload the car and gather ourselves before we go out for the rest of tonight's festivities. We're going to go to the movies, which is like one of my favorite things to ever do because... I love watching movies. I'm such a cancer. I'm like, okay, if I'm going to leave the house, I want to go sit in a dark room and watch a movie. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways, before we run out the door, I actually have to leave in five minutes, so I'm going to try to make this quick. I wanted to share with you guys some amazing sales and promotions going on this weekend with my products through Morphe because I know that on Twitter and in store people have been so excited but I haven't actually talked about it and everything ends on President's Day so I want to jump on here and tell you guys what's going on in case you're interested in getting some free stuff this weekend if you purchase the Jaclyn Hill palette first or second in store not online but in store you will receive a free makeup bag and not just any random makeup bag but the makeup bag that i created it's the large super silver glittery makeup bag that's like very durable and holds a lot of your crap that makeup bag <laughs> i've seen so many people on twitter so excited about it because me and morphe really did not talk about it or like promote it at all so it's been kind of a surprise but but uh, yeah, just like a little fun thing for this weekend and in celebration of the launch. So if you purchase a product in store, you will get a free makeup bag along with it. So alongside of that, if you purchase any of the Jaclyn Cosmetics Holiday Highlight Collection, like any highlight through Morphe online or in store during this weekend, you are going to receive a free makeup brush from Jaclyn Cosmetics that is the brush for that product. So if you purchase the extra beaming highlight in any shade, you're going to get the corresponding br blah, 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 the corresponding brush for beaming and so on and so forth. Same thing with the accent palette, the mood light, you're going to get the corresponding brush, the proper brush for that product for free, which is so cool. Like I was kind of shocked when they brought this to me and asked me if I would be cool with this promotion. And I just think it's so amazing because my brushes aren't cheap. So the fact that if you purchase a highlight, you get a free brush with it. I just think it's super, super cool. So that lasts only through the weekend. And then if that's not enough, my original brush set that I created with Morphe, as you guys know, I have an eye set and I have a face set. My face set is 50% off through the weekend, which is so cool. <laughs> like that's such a big deal. There's other brush sets on their website as well that are 50% off but 50% off through the entire weekend for my full face set which is awesome that's online and in store as well and then don't forget on top of all this you can use code jack attack in all caps to save extra moolah but you cannot use it on my brand Jacqueline cosmetics just like anything if you want to purchase jeffree star cosmetics if you want to purchase lunar beauty you can't use a code you can only use it on morphe products so just keep that in mind but those codes it does work online and in store so don't forget to use a code at checkout to save yourself 10% off. I know I sound like a broken record, but I don't care. So yeah, I just want to give you guys those details before I run out the door and go watch this new Harley Quinn movie. I don't even remember what it's called. Birds of Prey, I think. I'm excited because I love Margot Robbie. I know people like kind of hate on Harley Quinn, but I'm in it because she's hot and a badass bitch. So I'm just sitting with my popcorn like, yes, goals, yes, body, yes, yes, yes. 
yeah, but ultimately, I want to know what you guys think about it. Do you think that it's great that she's giving away so many free products? Or do you think that it cheapens her brand since she's like all about being bougie and fancy? Or do you think that it's really cool that a lot of people get a lot more bang for their buck? Like, you can kind of see it both ways, but it's all a matter of perspective. So, I'm really interested to see what you guys think about it. So, I actually got to hang out with a beauty guru recently, a real one. I really respect her. She's almost at 100,000 subscribers. She gives really honest, detailed reviews when it comes to luxury skincare, luxury makeup. And I really love her and respect her a lot. And uh, we got a chance to sit down together. And I had her go through some of my bag, not all of my makeup bag, but some of my items. Because I wanted to see her thoughts and opinions on some of the makeup that I carry when traveling. Um, it's really funny. And I'll leave her link down below if you want to check her out. We love our energy as much as I do, so let's get into that. Okay, guys, so I'm here with Michelle Wong. Yeah, I'll put her link down below. I love her. If you like amazing beauty gurus without the drama, it's right here. It's like straight up and honest. That's what I like about your channel. Okay, <laughs> okay, so she's gonna be reviewing my makeup and just like, her thoughts and opinions on it. So, okay, here we go. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, let me. Okay, go ahead. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Wait, you, go, you want to just go? Well, I want you to comment on the these bags. Okay, first of all, these bags go inside the Toiletry 26 Louis Vuitton. They oh, go okay. in it. See how they're kind of shaped just like it? I see. So it goes in it so it doesn't like... Oh, it's like a protector. Protector, yeah. Oh, okay. But I was going to say, I'm like, what is, Rich, what is this? <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. Well, okay, why is this still in the box? I just bought that. Oh, okay. And I didn't like it, so okay. I left it in there. I didn't like it because it had like a glitter sheen to it. I like a more matte bronzer. Oh, um, it's a bronzer. Yeah, okay. I, yeah, it's a bronzer. Uh, do you like your bronzers to have like a glitter in it or just matte? In between. I yeah. like it kind of like a satin finish. Exactly. And so with me, I kind of like a satin finish. So oh, I just this like, does have look, look how new that looks. I literally just like but tapped it, has, it one day and I was like, you know, see it. it has like micro glitters in it. Yeah, and it doesn't even sh like seem like it would, you know? Can you return this? Um, I just I'd rather like give it to a friend and just like return it. Oh know? wow, that's really glittery. Yeah. Okay. Wait, there you go. Not, that <laughs> the state of the art camera. <laughs> but it's there. Look at but that. I mean, what do you think about Givenchy makeup? Because I also have something else here. Um, it's okay. Yeah. It's not my favorite. Really? Yeah, it's okay. Oh well, here's a Givenchy foundation. <laughs> okay, I think I tried one of the foundations. <laughs> what is happening? Is this a tester? No, it's not a tester. That was a PR. I got it in PR. Oh, okay. I was like, yeah, but I like it. Do you like? Me. Is that what you're wearing now? Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's like a medium full coverage. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't even say full coverage. Not full coverage for me. I think <laughs> I've had it for a while. Okay. <laughs> this is my problem with Givenchy okay. foundations. It bothers my skin, and I don't know what it is in there. Do you think that? Do you think it smells like paint? Kind of like the Wet and Wild um, foundation smells like paint. I don't know what in world. Oh my gosh. See guys. No, it smells like like floral, but it just smells like something. I don't know if that's what bothers my skin, but I feel like it. What well, do you think foundations it. need a floral scent or any scent? Or do you like them with no scent? I prefer no scent. Yeah. But I do know sometimes I need to cover something up. Yeah, this is like. Okay, let me see. You know, it smells mm, like Chanel. Yeah. A little that... sub or something yeah, yeah, like that. Yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Okay. All right, uh, let me see. okay, I want to know your opinion. Oh, go ahead. No, no, I was going to okay. say, what else you got for me? Yes. What is this? The Ciate London oh, setting okay. powder. I've never tried anything from them. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, it's got. It's kind of messy. because you know, Is gotta, there no sifter? Oh, no, it's down there. Okay. Yeah. Do you like this? Do you have this on? Mm-hmm. have. I'm very particular with the setting powders. Okay, I would say this was a good one, but like my least favorite one. Okay, um, I don't know if you, if you guys tried this one. Rich. Well, that was a really good one. That was. <laughs> no, you know what? I have heard good things about this. The powder was really but aren't good. But you, aren't you kind of, I don't want to, I don't want to stir up drama. Go ahead. But aren't you kind of like scared to use her makeup? <laughs> Uh, I believe in like second chances okay. and stuff like that. And okay. like when I tried this one, I actually liked it. So so everyone's been telling me this is just like the, the Lancome. Okay, I don't even know what it is. Absolutely. That's the thing. <laughs> what because this is? even like the description, I'm like, well, it's not a setting powder, <laughs> but it's not a highlighter. 
it's like, what is it? This is definitely a highlighter. I mean, it's a subtle one, but it's... She's, cause Jacqueline was like, oh, it gives you that beautiful glow. Well, someone like Jacqueline, I feel like would put yeah. this all over her face, but yeah. I think yeah, anyone else Yeah, so she kind of does it. too. Um, let me see what it, what it says. In the bottom, it says um, luminous powder. That's it. But oh. does it say highlighter to me? Okay. But is it a highlighter to you? Yeah, okay. I would I would wear this so as a highlighter. It's like a, that. it's like a, here's the thing. Cause when people think of highlighter, they think of like right here, like blinding. Yeah. But this is almost like a natural glow. Like this gives you like that glow type of thing. Yeah, I think it's supposed, but there there are like glitters. Okay. Like okay. full on glitters. So if you want like a natural glow, definitely try that one out. Cause that's what it gives me. Yeah, I mean. But it is like a highlighter type of thing. Very oh, wait, soft. So, wait, was this? See? There she goes. Wait, was this was this the product with the same batch code? They they always have. Well, I don't even know. I'm not saying. Okay. Anything. I don't even know. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, my okay. These are my okay. These are my favorites. Okay, I know you're Tahari? like Tahari. Tahari. Okay. I know. I know what you're gonna say. go ahead. No, I. <laughs> I almost worked for Tahari. The the fashion company. The, or the, the clothing line. Wow. Like a gazillion years ago. Mm -hmm. He was creepy. <laughs> really? Ellie Tahari, yeah. Wait, Tahari's not yeah. a woman? No, 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 it's a man. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Okay, well, <laughs> did you ever meet him? Yeah. Did, did you feel like he had a vibe for makeup? No. So, you think this <laughs> is like... No, yeah, they're just like licensing This is like, stuff. people know yeah. our name and yeah. our clothing, let's do makeup too. Yeah. Okay. Um, let what me see. The, another, another person who's known for clothing, but let's do makeup too. Isaac Mizrahi. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> this is it right here. And that's what I was telling you about. Okay. This is really light. Yeah. It and it like kind of looks like Kate Spade. Oh yeah. 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 With the okay. coconut. Oh, here's the logo in the front. So all the haters. Okay. You can see, cause they're not going to believe you. They're going to be shook. Isaac Mizrahi. I mean, he was so big. Yeah. For a while there. Boom. Okay. <gasps> This looks now, like yeah, it's very synthetic brush. That's not cute. Yeah, I get it. This feel. Well, what do you think? Because this feels okay. kind of terrible. I don't like it because I go like this, right? And then back here, I guess. Well, this part here will scratch me. Okay. Yeah. It's just very poorly made. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's kind of like to me, it's a miss. But it's yeah. one of those brushes that's like it kind of does the trick. If you need, mm. if you was, need something, did you buy this? Yeah, it's like three bucks. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me see. Okay, here we go. Who's that? <laughs> this is Kylie. <laughs> now I have I actually have complaints with this one because when I bought it, yeah. it was it wasn't as pigmented as I thought it would be. It was very subtle, okay. soft uh, blush. And then I was like, well, maybe that's what I should go for. Not so heavy, heavy, heavy blush up in here. But I, I don't put any on today. Okay. I, just, I was gonna say it's very. Very soft, which I was kind of shocked that it was like like that. It is you actually see, boom. Look, boom. We didn't even. Where's it at? Nowhere. Yeah, it's it's weird. It's like is it? I don't understand why it doesn't like pop up as much. Yeah. Well, okay. it really. It's not even just like the color. It really just kind of blends away. Okay, this one is a tried and true, and I think I got the wrong one. We you know when you ask for something at the store, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want this one to give you like a little by mistake. Okay. So this is going to be the Chanel. Oh, Ooh, that's a good one. Okay. But is this the one with the glitter or the matte? Because I think it's the one with the glitter. I'm not sure though. This is like a satin. So, But okay. there is one that's with matte. like, like it's like a glitter top coat. Okay. That looks black Let's in see. the pan. Here we go. Yeah. That's part of like their, their like regular line. Yeah. Wait, do you see any glitter in there? No, right? No, it's yeah. just like a satin. So I use this one um, for like, I need to fill in my brows. Oh, I okay. get that little brush and I just like fill in the brows. Okay. Um, and yeah. These are great. They're really creamy and they last like all day and they just have like really nice. It's like not patchy yeah. at all. See, I feel like, I, I feel like a lot of your makeup is all high end and mine's just like all over the place. I don't even know what I'm I know, doing. you have a little bit of everything. Yeah. And like, so, like this. <laughs> like you'll go from Givenchy to Isaac Mizrahi, <laughs> Chanel to Tahari. Uh -huh. It's like back and forth. Okay. Yeah. Uh, another one. Here okay. is the S it has SPF 15, which I don't really like. I don't like foundation with SPF because I feel like it gets watery sometimes. Okay. Like they have to get the fo the formula right. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I would have to agree with you on that. And actually, right. a makeup artist told me um, that most medium to high coverage foundations can't have SPF in there mm. because it 
immediately dilutes like the pigmentation. Okay. Um, I've never tried this. I don't like anything that's velvet. I have really dry skin. So anything that's velvet, mm -hmm. I kind of stay away from. Okay. <laughs> a primer by Milani. Okay. Do you familiar with the brand? Um, a little. <laughs> like, I'm like, oh my God. A little. A little. I, I like their eyeshadows. Okay. I've tried their eyeshadows. I didn't know that they actually had like a whole primer yeah. situation. Is it good? I like it. Okay. It's not like the best, but I love it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then this one is by, okay, this is like, okay, don't come for me. I got this at Kohl's. Okay. <laughs> you know that? I don't know if you know that store, store called Kohl's. It's by a thing, it's by a brand called, uh, I don't even know the brand. Hold on. It's right here. It just says beauty. Yeah, but it says, it. Very like, vague. I think it says pop beauty. No. Yeah. Pop sugar beauty. And what I like isn't about that a it. Site? Isn't that a blog? Yeah. Pop sugar? Okay. Yeah. It's like, yeah. So. It's like a jelly highlighter, oh, and it gives me oh. that sheen. That is See like that? major glitter. Ooh, yeah. And That's I, nice. I like it, but it's, it's a jelly. It's not. Yeah, it's very jelly and wet. Oh, it's like yeah. yeah. And so this is kind of like the like Fenty by Rihanna one, but this one it just feels so good. And I just put it like up on my little pier and like up here. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Um. So this was a surprise hit then for you. Yeah, you surprise think? hit. Shook. Are there holes uh, here? I don't know. Do you wear um, like eyelash glue or no? Um, when I wear lashes, I'll wear I'll use lash glue, but so, I don't wear lashes. Often. I use Kiss Kiss Cosmo. Oh, Kiss. Okay. Yeah, and I use this one with um, out the formaldehyde or something. Okay. Yeah, because then it makes my eyes red. So this is like the it has uh -huh. aloe vera in it. Oh. The aloe, and then it has like uh, so I'll say like for formaldehyde free. Does it okay. smell like rotting fish, like all other? Wait, does it? No, actually. Okay, good. Woo! That's so okay. weird. It actually smells nice. Yes. Let me see what I got here. Okay, for brows, I love this one. So I'm gonna try it in true. It's a dip brow. It's kind of like, what? You fill it in. This was a huge fail for me. What? Because it's so wet. I mean, it works for your brows, because your brows are like, Maybe they're like, thicker, I don't know. Yeah, no, yeah. you have like more brow hair. See how like mm -hmm. my brow uh, hair is kind of like spotty? So a pencil goes a long way for you then? I guess. Yeah, or I just need something that's thicker. Like this is really wet, so it just looks really messy. Mm. It looked like shoe polish. It looked like I put shoe polish. <laughs> Damn. It was terrible. Okay, I'm um, trying to see what else I got here that you might like. Let me see. Um, my brushes are, these are like my travel brushes and they're very like, very inexpensive. So I'm a big Paris Hilton fan. These are like, she has brushes? Yeah, Paris Hilton brushes. God. Uh, yeah, these Paris She Hilton won't go brushes. away. Yeah, she does makeup and brushes. Does she really? Mm -hmm. Wait, didn't she come out with like skincare? And skincare now too. Yeah. Let me see. I think, I think that's all I, oh, here, oh my God. Oh, like I keep raving about these. So here's two of them. So this is the Mac Studio Cream Contour Sticks. I think those are both the highlights um, okay. and the bronzer one. It's probably it's probably still in the restroom, but it's uh, comparable to like the KKW. This is bronzer. Oh, okay. Yeah. So remember the KKW sticks, the con the cream sticks, when she came out with. Didn't everyone lose their minds over those because it had no product in there? Was like, that was that it? Yeah. Okay. So this feel I feel like doesn't have no product in it either, but it's very creamy. Okay. But it's only two dollars and ninety nine cents ah. by Mac Studio, and I don't feel like people talk about Mac Studio. Are they a makeup company or a company? I don't know. I don't know what they we are. Don't know. Where'd you get these? Uh, Marshalls. Okay. Um, and I was like, Marshalls, I look out for these. Yeah, I love cream <laughs> over powder because cream will last longer. In my as well for bronzer and highlight just for makeup period like even instead of using a liquid foundation use like a cream foundation oh yeah. i see yeah. i see what you're saying i just feel like oh it'll last you longer. okay okay um okay i think that's it oh and then i've got palettes but i think we won't we won't talk about those i think we're good so uh, definitely it's like air all over the place like i w i wish i could come and be like yeah this is the whole entire like I don't know, Kevin Aquan, everything, or like right. one brand that I use, but it's like a little bit of everything. But you know what? Work. You'll never know where you find like gems, like yeah. these, like these two ninety nine. dollars Yeah, I, I, they work for me. Yeah. But I just feel like, for those who don't know, do you want to tell them about your channel, what it is? Oh, well, I just, I focus on luxury beauty. Yeah. So that's just what she I decided <laughs> my ni my niche was going to be. <laughs> and so for her to see myself, I was kind of like scared of what she would say about it. 
No, um, I mean, I just, I love all kinds of makeup. I yeah. mean, I just can't buy it all. So I had to pick, I had to pick something. Yeah, okay. Um, but I'm glad. Okay, so yeah. what would you rate my makeup from 10 being like, oh my gosh, amazing. Okay. <laughs> from, but I, from your point of view. <laughs> this is so bad. I was, I mean, I'm sorry. I have to say this like brings it down. <laughs> this brings it down. Okay. Was this sent to you? No, I bought that. Yeah. Um, this brings it to <laughs> <laughs> the Tahari. Okay, so I need to get rid of all my Tahari stuff. All my I think Ms. Roddy stuff. Yeah. Um, and then the other stuff I just kind of don't know. <laughs> but this was good. Yeah. <laughs> this this seems like a good find. Yeah. I okay. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say a a seven. Okay. So here's a seven. So my challenge is the next time I see you. Okay. I'm gonna show you my, I'm gonna upgrade. I want improvement. An improvement, yeah. <laughs> like literally. Okay, guys, I hope you love her as much as I do. Please check out her channel, I'll leave a link down below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.